Cyberbullying. This has been a controversy in our society for a while now. It could be a simple I hate you over Facebook or the phone. Only 1 in 10 people tell their parents about cyberbullying. Girls are somewhat more likely than boys to be involved in cyberbullying. Um, I've been cyberbullied before by my ex-boyfriend. Um, he wrote like a whole paragraph on his Facebook about me and he like wrote my whole name on it. But like I blocked him on Facebook so I wasn't able to see it but the whole school was. And um, I didn't do anything about it. I just like told him to take it off. And this kid messaged me on Facebook and he told me he wanted to meet me at Vets Park to fight me. Because apparently I went ham and uh, blew her up here. So I got scared and I didn't go. Yes, I have back in the day on MySpace when people want to talk about you or exclude you without saying your name, but clearly like pointing you out and making you feel like that. So. I've been cyberbullied before, and it was just basically being called names, like you're talking about in school, moment, and didn't do anything about it, kind of feel defenseless. Yeah, like he's just another person on the other side of a computer, I don't think you should pay attention to what he's saying, I mean, come on, really? You shouldn't let it happen in silence. They should try to talk to someone like an adult, their parent, guidance counselor, or teacher, and um, help them with it. Or a friend, but I don't know. Sometimes I go crazy at you know, and try to do something serious. What I would suggest for any student who is being cyberbullied would be to seek the counsel of one of their guidance counselors here at school. Probably at first tell them to delete that friend if it was a friend on Facebook and ignore it initially. And if it got to be consistent, then I would probably contact the student's school and speak to their guidance counselor and possibly have their parents involved in a conference. What advice would I give students if they're being cyber bullied? Uh, I would say they need to tell someone. They need to tell an adult. Uh, no kind of bullying is acceptable, whether it's cyberbullying in person. Um, they shouldn't keep it to themselves and dwell on it, because uh, otherwise it can be... Not to respond to the bully, because they're looking for a reaction from you. I would block them if they're on your regular list, but keep the information that they sent you in case it continues. I would tell someone and someone that you trust, an adult, maybe your parents, or someone in the school. But the best thing you could do is not respond to the bully. How do we deal with cyberbullying? Uh, we deal with cyberbullying the way we deal with any other form of bullying. We, um, a student tells us that there's a problem, and we ask them, if they have anything they can show us, and sometimes with cyberbullying, they actually have things they can print out from their computer. Um, and then once we, once the student tells us that they have a bullying problem, we refer it to the bullying coordinator, and we take it from there. We take cyberbullying as seriously as any other kind of bullying. But cyberbullying, well, in the state of New Jersey, there's a new uh, harassment, intimidation, and bull bully law that's being put into place, and there's. School, district, school districts are mandated to, uh, every school has to have a bullying specialist. So any case of any type of bullying or harassment, whether it be cyberbullying, whether it be you know, regular bullying, whatever, um, it gets, uh, a form gets filled out, it gets turned into our bullying specialist, who here in this school is Ms. Parker, um, and she has to evaluate the case, take statements from people, um, document it, and then the administration gets it, and we have to look at each um, individual person involved in the in the bullying incident and, and uh, make a judgment call on it. 